Well, Agnes Gatow is a partner at the Africa advisory firm, GBS Africa. She joins us now live from London. Thanks so much for speaking to us, Agnes. Uh, where does this leave uh, Nene at this point? And yeah, is, is, just get, bring us up to speed on, on how he may or may not be treated by Ramaphosa now that he's made that request. Well, the latest news is the fact that he is going to represent South Africa at the IMF meeting, uh, which is which is taking place l uh, later this week. So that means that Nene is still taking in charge of the of the finance docket. And well, my view, to be honest, is he has disclosed the fact that he visited the Gupta family, but he hasn't. Nobody has proven that he's actually been guilty or what what crime what economic crime. He, he committed by visiting uh, the Gupta family. I think he's been honest um, by coming out to the Zoro Commission and, and, and saying the truth that he actually visited them. But were you in his situation that time? You had President Zuma, you know, fronting this family as a finance minister, perhaps under duress. You're forced to meet with these guys. What, what would you do? Right. You know what, Agnes? I, thank you so much uh, for that. This is this saga never seems to end. Uh, with the Gupta family affecting just every high-level minister, it seems, of the ANC. So thanks so much for that. Unfortunately, we're going to have to leave it there.